How to merge two photos on Canva. Hi, welcome to Tech Tricks tutorial. Today, we're going to show you how to merge two photos on Canva. So this is a step-by-step -step beginner guide for everyone to follow easily. If you find this tutorial helpful, please don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. And now let's get right into it. So first, I already have a blank page right here. So the size of this one is 16 by 9, but you can actually choose any size of your choice. So the next thing that we are going to do is we are going to choose two photos, either in your upload section or you could also use the free photos here at Canva. So I'm going to use the free photos here at Canva. Go to Elements section and there you can see all the photos right there. So here in the photo section, say for instance, I'm going to make use of this first photo I have right here. Now I'm just going to double tap on it and reposition the specific place of the photo that I want to add onto the space. So there you have it. Okay, now we're going to add another page. So just click on the plus button below and then we're going to add and drag the next photo still the same process um, i'm gonna double click on the photo and drag it to the place or the position i want to show on the page now the next thing that we are going to do is here in the element section we are going to search for transparent to fade or fade to transparent gradient there and afterwards we're gonna see all the transparent um gradients available for us so most of the gradient effects are actually available for the canva pro users however we're gonna make use of this one which is a free one and we're simply gonna reposition it to the place where we want to um, remove the background so there so let's simply resize it and what we are going to do next is we're going to change the color. So instead of the gray one, we're going to have white instead so that it will have a more gradient effect to it. Okay, there you have it. Now we're simply going to duplicate this one and continue the process. Okay, so there, continue duplicating until you have already covered all the places that you would want to um, cover up in that specific picture okay now simply continue the process once done uh, select all and group do the same thing onto the next picture so you can actually simply copy and paste the last gradient picture that you have grouped and there. Let's download the second picture. Now once you have downloaded the second picture, we are going to upload it right here onto our upload section of the Canva. Alright. Now once you have uploaded the photo, we are going to go back to our first page. And we are going to simply drag the photo or click on the photo and um, resize it accordingly there so next step that we are going to do is we're going to go to the transparency section and we're going to reduce its transparency afterwards so as you can see um, the picture or the second picture is showing up already okay now there next thing that we are going to do is we are going to download the photo once more and uh, make sure that the file type is in jpg or png form now let's add another page so once we have downloaded the photo okay, simply upload the downloaded photo that we have again and then drag the photo onto the blank page now, what we're going to do next is to tap on the photo and after the, which we are going to go to the menu bar and hit on edit photo. So, let's go to the adjust section right here. And after that, what you're going to do is you're going to simply um, reduce the brightness, increase the contrast, and as well as the saturation. So, 
that's about it for today's video i hope you find this video helpful and thank you so much for watching